Hello everyone, welcome back to another video. Today I decided to do more of my Renovate The Sims 4 series because um, it's been a while since I've done, since I like even started that. Um, I started that about eight months ago. Oh god, that was an awful video. I put that on private now because it was just awful. I hated watching it so much. It was actually so cringy. The audio was terrible quality and I could not speak to it. Actually, not, nothing's changed. I still can't speak. <laughs> what the heck am I saying? But um, I decided to do the series because, I don't know, I just wasn't a huge fan of any of the lots. Lots in the game, or like, just literally any of the houses in the game, like, I was not a fan of at all. So I decided to um, start the series where I just make my own Sims 4, <laughs> pretty much, and like, create my own NPCs, so I'm gonna be, or townies, I think that that's the name for them, right? I, I have no idea. So I'm pretty much gonna also start a Creatism series, where I'm gonna be doing that as well. Um, I, I think I'll be starting that much later on, like around spring break, because my schedules are already pretty big. I'm already trying to do three videos a week, and I'm working a lot, so, and then on top of that, I'm a student. <laughs> so, uh, I'm, like, trying to keep on top and stay on top of everything. It's kind of hard, but, um, anyway, for this lot, I decided to renovate the Blue Velvet because I never really went to that lot because it just felt so dark and, like, closed off and, like, there really was not that much to do. I mean, like, at first, when I remember first, when I first downloaded the game, this was, like, one of the first lots that I went to and, like, I loved it, but it just, like, I felt like it needed a little something else. I don't know. So, I felt like, because that was the first lot that I went to, I, hey, I might as well, that might as well be, like, the first public lot that I renovate in this series. Um, I think next week I should have a, another, like, renovation. I think I might do a mansion or something. I, that might take a little bit too much time, but, um, or I could just do, like, a quick, like, starter home build. I think that would be good, too. I'm just, like, just trying to find the time to get all this done because I, I really care about this and I really want to get it done because, I'm, I don't know, I'm passionate about it. I want to I want to start this little YouTube thing. I'm kind of passionate about that, you know what I mean? Um, and I turned, I changed the slot from a nightclub to a, um, to a restaurant because, I don't know, I just wanted to have a, um, a restaurant lot in Willow Creek and I felt like this was a perfect lot. So, like, even though it has that restaurant vibe and it is built like a restaurant, I still wanted it to be like a club as well. Like the Blue Velvet is a nightclub, you know what I mean? So it's still like a jazz club kind of a thing. I, so I tried, I wish we had stages in this game, but we don't have stages, unfortunately. So I just had to make like a little, you'll see it, it's a little blue stage, you know, like kind of like blue, playing off the Blue Velvet vibe. <laughs> that's, that's where I was coming from. But I did have a lot of fun. Like I always say, I had a lot of fun building this lot. I don't know, because building and interior design, that kind of stuff is my passion, and why not, why not practice it and, like, share it with the world, you know what I mean, share my, share my love of interior design and exterior design with everyone. How, how long is this? Let's build, let's see, okay, so it's like, it's 12 minutes, that's, that's not terrible, that's not a super long video. My last video, I just edited, um, a mansion build, I think it's scheduled to upload, it should already be uploaded by the time you watch it, so go watch that, um, <laughs> I think it's a Kriegel style build, um, but it was sped up so fast, like, watching the footage back kind of made me dizzy, so I decided to try and slow down the footage today, just to kind of, like, chill out a little bit, <laughs> Because that footage was a little fast, and I, I don't know, I just wanted to make it just calm down, take it down a few notches, because I didn't want to feel dizzy after I was done edi editing a video. Ah, oh my god, I just, I think, when did I start building this? I think I did this like two or three hours ago, so it took me like two and a half hours, that's not that bad. This is the little blue velvet stage that I was talking about. Oh, also, you're going to see all the lights, they're literally not hanging on to anything, they're just floating and like mid-air you're gonna see that in the screenshots too but I went in and like added in like little trellises I think that's what they're called so like there's little crosses going across the thing like little I don't even know how to explain it if I have a screenshot of it I'll try to remember to put it in but I don't I don't think I do I don't know it'll it'll, it'll be up on the gallery so you should go download it so you can see what it looks like now <laughs> but um this entire day <laughs> I had to spend spend about Oh god, I think it was like 
two hours, two, three hours in um, a dealership trying to get a key fob for my car, which was, let me tell you, that was quite the annoying experience. It might, let me, like, I'm very grateful that I have these kinds of issues, but, like, it was just very obnoxious <laughs> that I had to wait for two hours to get a damn key fob. Like, really, come on, it's a stupid key fob. Like, why can't I just go in, they gave me the thing, and then I leave. I mean, I'm, I'm sure it's, I, I don't know, it was just very obnoxious. <laughs> oh my lord, that was, yeah, that, that was, that was my entire day, that just took my entire day, because as soon as I woke up, I was like, oh Christ, now I have to go to this stupid appointment and wait for this, for these random people to, like, program my key fob. It was so annoying. So then I was literally sitting in the middle of the dealership with my... <laughs> get this in my slippers my i i don't even know how to like explain them they they look like boat shoes but they're slippers that's what they're, that's pretty much what they are with my long sleeve like pajama shirt on and some like gray joggers like that <laughs> i walked up into this place and i was like i'm listen i'm done just give me whatever i need and i would like to go <laughs> right now because i'm so done sorry if i i'm trying to speak quietly because it's 10 o'clock right now and everyone in my house everyone in my family is sleeping right now um also you'll notice in the blue velvet i decided to change the bathroom into um the kitchen area because it's a restaurant and i also decided to change the bar area into a bathroom and then i moved the bar outside so i don't know i just did a little bit of like adding on some new things i never whenever i try whenever i do these builds i try my hardest to not like change the shape of the place like yeah sure i'll take down one or two walls to like really open up the space or i'll add in a bunch of walls like this like that's something you can do in real life is like add on walls to a build <laughs> you know what i mean like you can't just if you're renovating a house you can't just like destroy every single wall inside of it inside of the place because like that's just not realistic, but, um, this is what I was talking about before with the stage. I really wish we had stages in this game. <laughs> they give us one thing, and then I'm already asking for another thing, like, they give us laundry. I was complaining about that earlier, <laughs> and I'm already asking for, like, stages, new build tools. I don't know, it's just something that would be kind of cool, I wish, I guess. Like, I, I used the stages all the time from The Sims 3. I miss that game. If you guys want to see, like, a Sims 3 Let's Play, it would probably be laggy, because that's what it that's what it's like on my computer <laughs> but i would be more than happy to like do a sims 3 let's play uh, like even when i like upgrade if, even if i upgrade my computer like i'm uh, and like it's a better quality video i'd be more than happy to do like a sims 3 let's play because i i grew up on the game i've been playing the game since like god like the end of fifth grade i think it was that summer I'm a senior in high school now, <laughs> it was the end of the fifth grade, or, like, the beginning of, like, summer in fifth grade is when I watched, started watching Queen's videos, um, and I can't, I can't remember the time period, but, like, I, never mind, but, um, I had been watching her videos, and I think it was the Showtime Let's Play of hers that made me bought that game, I don't know, it just warms my heart thinking about that, it's so nostalgic, like, I can, I can thank, I can genuinely thank Queen for, getting me into the sims because that is what like helped like change i don't know like it, it was such a good creative outlet for me and i was like there were some days where i was just not so happy you know what i mean like i, I don't want to get into details but like i was able to just like go home and play the sims and like be in a different world for a second you know what i mean just like not have to be around all the crap that was going on you know what i mean and like I, I, was, I just wasn't really confident in myself, so I, I don't know, I feel like that was just, like, a good outlet, like, a good creative outlet for me, and so I thank Queen for that, um, and know, uh, in my, deep down in my heart, that she's resting peacefully in heaven, <laughs> god, this just got deep quick, oh my lord, it's, it's the sleep that's getting to me, oh my lord, it's the sleepiness that's getting to me, but this is the little outdoor space that I was talking about, this, like, a little, enclo like, whatever this thing is that I'm trying to create right here, um, it changes. It doesn't end up looking like this, this weird little rhombus-looking thing. I have no idea what to call it. <laughs> but, um, I don't know, because I, I added this in here because I wanted to have, like, 
a wall with all the nectar you could say behind it and like I couldn't just do that with no wall you know what I mean and I feel like that's just like a normal thing I feel like if you see a bar that's outside kind of like this like there's gonna be like an enclosure enclosure around it so and, and I like how it turned out I think it looks good um I don't know what what, what else do I talk about how's your guys' week oh I think it no break break was like a while ago happy martin luther king jr day that's today <laughs> i spent my entire day in a dealership waiting for a key fob while it was martin luther king jr day i should tweet about that <laughs> i should go into my on my discord service and be like hi happy happy martin luther king jr day if you're celebrating it because <laughs> it's very important um this is the kitchen right here i didn't know i didn't really know what to do with that i just added on like three different little kitchen stations and then I just throw up some posters and I don't know I, I work in a restaurant so like I kind of have a vibe of what, what like a kitchen looks like um and like what the door I, I, I don't know I like kind of have an idea of how things run so I kind of use some inspiration let's say that's a little hint <laughs> inspiration for what from where I work I, there's literally nothing looks the same but <laughs> I don't know. I I literally don't know what I'm saying. I'm actually so sleep deprived. I have to wake up early tomorrow morning to go to school, and I don't want to do that. And then I have to work every single night this week. I'm not ready. <laughs> if you are working and you are in high school, you're working two jobs. Props to you because it is annoying. Let me tell you, it is kind of hard to like juggle everything else on top of that. So props to you. Anyway, I think this video is wrapping up shortly. So. Um, you'll see all the screenshots here in just a second, and you'll be able to vibe out to some original Sims 1 music, and I will see you all in the next video. This was a trash voiceover, like always, I apologize. <laughs> I will see you guys in the next video. Alright, bye guys.